Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, my name is Marco and today we are continuing Mob Psycho 100 season 2 episode number 6. Episode number 5 was brilliant. We got a second part of the battle between Mob and Mogami Keiji. Well, to be honest, in episode number 4 we didn't get so much of a fight, it was more the battle of wits, or should I say, battle of ideologies, and this guy is all about, uh, I mean Mogami Keiji, about negative emotions. He was basically trying to prove his point that negative emotions are stronger than positive ones, which obviously Mob debunked in the previous episode in that amazing fight. It's really good to have such an amazing anime studio doing the show like mob man because not everyone can animate these fights in such a unique way it's just too good like it's perfect i really liked dimple's motivational speech to mob while he was in that uh, illusion world that was probably one of my favorite scenes with dimple really great stuff and of course, Mob slowly getting back his memories, his emotions, thinking about Ritsu, Reagan, Tsubomi and his life and everything. He slowly came back to his senses. But after he defeated Mogami Keiji, he needed to get rid of all those evil spirits that Mogami Keiji captured. And he went beyond 100% to that question mark thing, which completely obliterated everything. So Matsuo grabbed Mogami Keiji, he left the body of the girl, Asagiri was her name, right? And she wasn't the nicest person as well, because the way she was presented in that illusion, that is literally her. When Mob asked her later on, are you really like that? She said yes, but she changed, because she. it seems like she was aware of what was going on while Mob and Mogabi were battling. So yeah, it was really enjoyable episode, I can't wait to see what's in store for me next, so without further ado, let's jump into episode number 6. Let's go! Alright, everything is ready, let's begin! Four years ago, oh interesting! Seems like we are in some sort of call center. Oh, it's Reagan. Is this like his best job or something? Before he became a psychic. <laughs> wow, he rented a place without any plans for his future. You too can become a millionaire. <laughs> oh my god. Is this mob working out? 34 is not bad at all. Nice. <laughs> of course not. It's gonna be progress if he keeps doing it. I'm so happy for him. Yep, are you proud, Dimple? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> They're gonna do it, oh my god. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Another customer. <laughs> oh, to both of them! <laughs><笑><笑> Oh. 
Wow. <laughs> yeah, I was like, she's still searching for them. <laughs> More importantly, that triggered her. Yep, it's just a great feeling, honestly. Yeah, man, I'm glad you're enjoying. Uh, that's kind of a bummer, right? Because he was enjoying himself. But he will come to help you. Oh, wow. That is true. <laughs> I did say that lots of times. Oh, wow. Ah, this kind of sucks, bro. He was really enjoying himself, and now he needs to go on this job. Oh my god, this fucking guy is similar to the first episode. Spirit. <laughs> oh my god. And it's couple again. It's first episode of Mobile over again. <laughs> and even the building looks the same. Oh, I was about to say, is he going to talk with him? Oh, I don't know if Reagan. This is the first time that Reagan might not choose the right word. Wow. <laughs> no, no, Reagan. That's absolutely not true. They were all so great. Telepathy Club and Body Improvement Club. He really had a great time. But Reagan doesn't know about that. Oof. Bro, what the fuck is going on? So he did not show up on the next job. Yeah, it was too much. It was. What the fuck are we suddenly at this point, bro? For a while. Oh my god. Yeah, it's not good to blindly follow someone either. And we know that Mob decided to be upfront about everything. It's a good decision, but Reagan needs to understand it. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> so it's actually a job that he can take. この家業はもともと俺の身一つで成立してきたんだ。モブがいなくて困ることなんかあるか。今までどおり、俺は自分の手に人権費だって削れるし、ガキの思春期相談でるべきだ。Bro, you guys need each other. I'm so glad that Mob has a smile on his face. Much more often right now. See, Reagan has the wrong opinion about this. Oh, and he literally sees Mob smiling with his friends. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, 
僕を使わなくなるぞお前はただの中学生の金魚の糞をこの先もずっとやっていくのか<笑><笑>そりゃ平和だことを選んだモブに利用価値はもうないただの中学生にひっついてせいぜい楽しく過ごしていい<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> That's fucking face 心配ねえなもう二度と会うこともないかもな What the fuck bro But it's so sudden man to distance themselves so much in short time period. <laughs> I'm not mentally prepared. Oh, mob on karaoke. Friend book. <laughs> okay, so basically Facebook. <laughs> Reagan needs to have something like mob is having right now in his life as well it's his birthday oh shit wait what see messages from your friends wishing you a happy birthday oh my god bro zero messages bro reagan is actually lonely i can keep Keep up, I need to read this to Ataka from mom. Kokuri san won't leave my house. Is this Reagan's mom? To Reagan Arataka. Happy birthday. How are you doing? How's work? Are you still in that shady business? Remember our neighbors, the Kobayashis. I he I heard that their oldest son got married just last month. You should hurry up and find a secure job. You still have a chance. You are still only twenty eight. If you want to another chance at life, you should probably make a decision fast. I fucking hate this because it's similar cul culture in my country as well. The family pressure, the social pressure. It's just so annoying and it's constantly about your head, man. So this is something I can really relate to, man. But I did not realize that Reagan actually doesn't have anyone in his life other than Mob. And he was relying on Mob so much. And Mob is in his, his teens, man. He needs to have this life to be happy to chill with his friends and to do things like this to go party to go uh, for a walk to go to the gym to go to the karaoke it's his time to have fun so reagan needs to realize that mob is at that age that it's perfectly normal for him to have all these activities and reagan was always Picturing Mob as a wimp that doesn't have any friends and that nobody would uh, hang out with him. And on the other hand, Mob, thanks to Reagan, Mob realized that he is the same as everyone else, that everyone is special in their own way, and that him having his powers doesn't make him less of a human being so uh, this is the episode i never thought we are going to get man let's continue uh, this is fucking depressing i actually never thought about reagan's social life nobody sent him a message for his birthday is he shaking looking for stuff recruitment invitation a cheerful and fun workplace have you ever heard of a company called uh, Whitey or Witty that works hard to make the world a better place to live? If you haven't, let me tell you about our company. It's not a difficult job, but it's definitely not an easy job either. But if you have the, 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 the determination to work hard, we'll welcome you with open arms. Wait. He's actually looking at job offers. Wow, what a transition. This is actually pretty sad, guys. This is pretty depressing episode. Holy crap, man. Happy trials. <laughs> oh, oh my god. 
That fucking chin. Oh, fuck. あいつ。弱い人間の溜まり場だ。聞いてくれ、レゲンさん。館長夫婦。ああ、and <笑> Bro, that's so fucking depressing. <laughs> I thought that he was actually fucking drunk. It's his first drink. Jesus Christ, man. <laughs> what? <laughs> Is he throwing up, bro? He did not even drink alcohol. Yeah, man, you need to sort yourself out. You are smart. That's a bit worrying. What the fuck is about to happen with Reagan, bro? <笑>シンラバンショマル。やめておき。我々の手に負えする手段を持たないジアンだったのだ。おお、エンドレイギンイズゴイングトゥドゥイト。複数のアカウントで連日深夜までレベルアップを記録を繰り返し、おとりしょ
it's a bad thing, but later on he realized. Basically, they both are spending too much time with, with each other, that they uh, put their other uh, needs aside. And not only needs, but basically their lives, their friends, they're not going out anywhere. And it was so fucking sad to see that it was Reagan's birthday and nobody sent him a message. He only received a message from his mom and some job offers. That was so fucking depressing. So uh, Mob really enjoyed his time with Body Improvement Club and Telepathy Club. And no, it's not like Reagan said that they're using him. They are generally good people, and it was so. I was so happy to see Mob smiling, and they're just uh, chilling, eating fries, and drinking, basically having fun, bro. They are kids, it's a normal thing. But that's the thing, we are witnessing Mob growing all these episodes while it was mostly thanks to Reagan and his advices. But also Mob deserves to have a normal life, like any other kid in his age. It's a perfectly normal thing, but Reagan is not realizing that. He believes that Mob will obey to whatever the heck he says. And when he saw that's not the case, he started to worry a little bit and he started reflecting on his own life and uh, why doesn't he have friends, man? And of course, there is that message that he needs to find a secure job and that uh, he's getting older, that there is still time that he can make things work out. So he's pressured by that as well. And he decided to pop off. Basically, he took all these jobs, man. He became very popular. Uh, bro of the Seasoning City is his new nickname. And he was invited to a TV show. But it appears that that fucker... Uh, Jodo or Jido, whatever the heck his name is, that old fella is still salty about what happened with uh, the episodes of Mogami Keiji. And that uh, uh, Reagan's special move with the knee, that attack, that's so fucking petty, man. But he intends to show people that he's a fraud, perhaps, that Reagan is a fraud and because he got so popular, this is going to completely crush him. So hopefully that will not happen. Honestly, such a great episode, bro. It's, it's really something else. I wasn't expecting it and it gave me anxiety, bro. Especially the part with Reagan opening his mails and him trembling and later on going to that bar. So he basically did not want to believe that Mob is actually having fun until he saw it himself. And then he realized, oh shit, what he was saying is true. He's growing, but what am I doing? And that's what we saw later on in the bar, that there is a bunch of these people, Reagan calls them weak, that wanted to share their stories. And Reagan was the one who listened to them and he was giving them advices all the time. So. They are the only ones who wished Reagan happy birthday and that bar seal was fucking depressing as well. The main thing is that the creator is doing fantastic job with characters, man. It's so fucking great. But I guess the main point is that they both need to have lives outside the Reagan's office. And that's 100% true. So yeah, the things that Reagan said about Mob being lonely and everything and then we saw scenes with him in the bar and in his room and I think it's about time that our boy Reagan gets some character development as well like this show is really awesome really fucking awesome I guess that's all for today thank you so much for watching guys I hope that you enjoyed if you did please consider subscribing leave a like comment all that good stuff as always Check out my Patreon page if you want to see a few episodes early and full reactions. I will be seeing you very soon with another video. Until then, take care and have a nice day. See ya guys.